Hello, all you space engineers out there. Commander Kingfish here, and it is day 45 here on the frozen rock. Uh, we... Well, last time we finished up, it was kind of a short episode, uh, but I finished, or had an idea in mind on how I wanted to finish this uh, mine shaft. And I'd been doing some thinking and I did some changing around. So I originally was going to use catwalks to uh, make kind of a, a shaft down through here, a tunnel, a uh, built-in tunnel. But then I was having some difficulties trying to do the lighting. So I've gone to a little bit different scheme that I think will look pretty good. Uh, I have put in uh, beam blocks and have... Uh, so to make it look like there's a beam, so is there structure holding the rock up. And then what I've done is uh, put a light in the middle of the beam, and that allows me to kind of light this section. So you can kind of see what it looks like here. And I am going to go every two blocks and then put another set of uh, beams in. So that'll kind of give the tunnel a bit of a look, a structured look and kind of a safety look. And then along the edge and upper in between the beams, I'm going with those light armor panels. And I'm not gonna finish those, I'm gonna leave those undone. So I think that'll look pretty good. So right now, uh, I need to take this out. And we'll get these out of here. And then I'm going to put, uh, let's see, I think I have them here. I'm going to put some form of, let's see if we can kind of show you what we're doing here. So these are half window walls. And I think what I want to do is put these in as, uh, and then enclose this area. So as you're sitting in the control seat, you can look out, you can see the mine, uh, the drills uh, working away, and uh, kind of go with that theme right through here. So that's kind of what the plan, and that's kind of what I want to get done today. I want to get this shaft done. Uh, and uh, try to finish up this mine as much as possible in today's episode. I really want to get back over to the base so I can start kind of moving forward on what uh, I want to, to do. Again, as I think I've mentioned, I think my final accomplishment for this season is to get to the point where I can get to space. I'm not going to do anything up there, and uh, at least for now, uh, once I get there, but that might be what I plan on doing in, you know, taking off in the future. I've got some other ideas for uh, uh, other things to do uh, for uh, uh, my next season and uh, I'm kind of excited about it but once we're closer to that I'll talk a little more about what I'm going to do there. And so all right let me I've got uh, a lot of work to do here and I've got to get uh, go grab, uh, gather materials and stuff like that. So once I get all my materials gathered up and I'm start ready to start building down there, uh, I'll catch back up with you all. All right, I am uh, back. I've actually done some wire framing down here. I think I have enough materials to finish this now. So let's uh, uh, let me start uh, kind of welding this up, and I'll kind of show you what I've got here. Uh, let's go ahead and weld these up. Uh, get uh, these done over here. Now there's going to be a door that's going to go in right here. And I have to decide on what kind of door I want to put in. Let me get see if I can get this other one welded. Come on. Oh, well. I'll be able to weld it. Now let's see if I can get out of here. Uh, shoot. Well, 
This is all we can do. Can I get... There we go. Alright. There we go. Problem solved. And let's get back to the welder here. Alright, so... We'll get this welded up. I went with that light gray to just kind of give it a, a, a different beam color. Because these are going to be unfinished. I'm going to leave these unfinished just as they are. Uh, this will get painted uh, yellow. I, I just marked them so that I knew which ones that I needed to uh, put the beams around. So that one's done. Let's uh, let's get this done. That's uh, not the one I wanted to weld, but there we go. That's the one I wanted to weld. But they are both needed welding anyway. All right, get that. And there we go. Oh, I got one back behind there. There we go. And let's get the bottom one here. Come on. There we go. All right. That's got that beam. Now I went two spaces in between. I kind of figured that would probably be about right for lighting purposes. So let's uh, get this one done. Oh, I'm going to run out of steel. Yep, alright. I gotta go get some more steel. I got that up above. No, I think that'll look alright. Uh, it'll kind of give the stru that structure of a tunnel. Uh... A built-out tunnel and uh, that'll be secure so it, it's not gonna look like it's going to fall in or cave in which is kind of the idea we're gonna have to live with this through here I don't think I, I just don't think there's a good way of putting any good structure or beams in through here but I think that's okay I think this will look fine so I think what I'm going to do now uh, is uh, let's put these steel, start putting these in. That can go there. That can go there. And then we want the upper one to go there. 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 All right, so we have the look of kind of a built-in structure down through here. All right, let's see if we can get this one in. There. there. Energy low. There. There. There, and there. All right. I'll finish welding up the beams because I know I've got enough to put my corridor in. I'm going to have to go get some more steel plating for the beams. I thought I was going to have enough, but those beams will take quite a bit. The other thing that uh, doing it like this, it leaves this corridor open. So if I wanted to put something in here, I can't. All right, so that's all the way through to here. All right, so we've got this corridor all done. All right, now let's put the lights in. Uh, it's four, let's go six. Uh, I am painting those red. All right. So we... All right, let's put this one in. Turn that. Oh. All right, there we go. And then I have my...
my particular color scheme. I like more of a yellowish light, so uh, that set it 214 and 177, which gives us a bit of a yellow, and I'm leaving it at 3.6 for the lighting. So you can kind of get a feel for how this will look. Uh, I'll end up putting some lighting in out here, maybe a light above the door right here. Although I might put a sensor above the door so that the door automatically opens and closes. So uh, we'll get to that. So let's put another one in down here on the ones that I have done anyway. There we go. And let's get this one set. Get the, the right one here. Okay, there's that. 177. And 3.6. All right. So if we look back, we kind of get the feel. All right, let's see where am I at. All right, this has to be done and this has to be done. Okay, I am going to go get charged up and I'm going to have to go over to the base and get some more steel. So I'll do that, and then when I'm ready to finish this section up and put the doors in, I'll catch back up with you all. All right, I am back. I got a few uh, uh, odds and ends done. I had to go get some more stone because I was running out of iron over there at the main base, so I took care of that. Actually, I uh, took all the stone that we had drilled out here and hauled that over there. And I've got all of my materials, I think. Although I said that before, I thought I had all of our materials. So let's uh, go ahead and start welding up. That one's finished. Let's get that done. And I should have enough. Alright, there's that one, that one. Oh, seriously? Oh, I made a faux pas. Well, we gotta take it out. I had put a round piece instead of a beam in there. All right, uh, P paint should be this color here. And we are on the beam block. All right, there, that looks better. All right, all right, that looks better. Hopefully I didn't do it down here as well. I don't think so. I think I got this one right. All right. All right, that's that side. There we go. There's that. All right. And that's in through there. All right, let's put our lights in. And those are red, so let's go back. Uh, six. Okay. That welded up. Get our settings in. Four. One, seven, seven. 
and the radius is 3.6. Okay, I think we just have one to put in here. Settings, 214, 177, 177, go 3.6. All right. I think that's going to look pretty good. You have this hallway or this tunnel that leads to to the main mining control room down here. Okay. So that's that. That's in place. Oh, I need to paint this. Let's uh, at least paint these one blocks. Uh, let's go to four. And I believe it should be that color. Yeah, there we go. Okay. All right, so I just got to finish this area right in here. And then we can start working on this area. So let's, let's actually pull out some doors. Let's see what we got for doors. What do we, th let's see what we think is going to be the best. Doors, doors. Uh, how about, well, let's just pull these down. Of course, it takes aluminum plates. Sliding door, offset door. Probably these offset doors will probably be the best. I think I can put them on the inside because I got that light there. So I'll have to put that out. Huh. Which means I'll probably have to put another block out and in here. Let's let's do that. My co-pilot has just joined me. All right, uh, Missy, come on, get around here. Get over here. Get over here and lay down. Oh, I need girders. All right, so I gotta go get girders and I think I needed uh, aluminum plates for, for the doors to be able to put those in. So let's grab those. All right, so I need some girders. Let's get uh, Any of those. Probably going to need another block. Come on, Missy. Get over here and lay down. Co-pilot is wanting to have all of the attention. All right. Let's get uh, about 20 of those so we can get that stuff in. 
probably need some more steel plates. I think that was everything that I needed down there. I should be done with the lighting for the time being. Let's take those out. I think uh, the co-pilot has uh, finally settled herself into place. Let's see if we can at least get one block built out here. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna have to put another block in there, which I can probably go ahead and do that. I just won't build it out. I just don't have enough concrete. All right, let's go to the door. Now, I'm thinking... Oh, geez, that's an offset door. Let's, uh, what other doors do we got? Well, it's a sliding hatch door. Don't want that, half sliding hatch. Just a plain old door. Sliding door and the offset door. You know, let me do something here. I have thought I had them loaded up, but maybe not. I don't see them. Hard window. All right. Well, you know what? I think I'm going to wait on the door. I might uh, have some other doors mods that uh, I would prefer as opposed to having this sticking out into the hallway. So I'm going to uh, hold off on the door. So let's uh, head down here. And let's kind of see what we want to do down here. Now again, I, uh, I might want to dig this out just a little bit more. So if we do something like this, make this room a little bit bigger, at least one block, uh, one block wider. So we'll add two more blocks on the floor because we'll have a wall space. But, uh, there we go. That's got that out of there. All right. Uh, let's change this to red. And we can kind of at least get a feel for this. There. There. All right. Yeah, I think one more.
right, let's see how one more will look in here. Yeah, that's going to be a wall, so we don't have to dig that out too much. I can go there. 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 All right. That's a wall, that's a wall. And then, uh, is it along there? There. Oh, out of girders. All right, we can kind of get the feel. So this is gonna kind of box in. Let's see what we can do with the, with the uh, windows, eight. Half window, half window inverted. And I don't know, let's see. Oh, I need girders for that as well. All right, let me go run up and get some girders. I'll grab some more concrete blocks. And we'll see if we can start getting some progress down there. All right, so girders. Let's go with about 60. And then we might as well grab these. All right. I think it's starting to take shape. Kind of starting to get a feel for how I want it to look. Let's uh, go ahead and do this. And then I probably will put, yeah, we'll need to put a couple of more out here. Let's change. Okay, we already got those at yellow. Let's go six there and there. Okay, so there we go. I think that's good. I wonder, you know what probably would look better here is a, let's go six. What if we put a half block in there? Of course, I think it's supposed to be red, but that's okay, we can fix that. Do that. Yeah, that gives it a little more interest, I think. That uh, at least a little more shape. It's not just a full block as it's coming into here. And then we can. Uh, I'm not sure. Well, probably you got to go at least too high on the roof, maybe. But let's get back over and see how our half windows are going to look. That will go there. Oh, uh, seriously? Because the control seat is there. Uh, all right, let's see if we can do this.
Let's see if we can turn those around. And you're not going to, are you going to let me do this? How about that? Yeah. Okay. Let's go back up. So you're sitting in the control seat. And you're looking around, you got uh, the glass panels there that you can look out and see your drills working away. I think that's uh, that'll look good. All right, let's get out of there. All right, I'll tell you what, I'm going to uh, grab materials. I'm going to frame this out in here a little bit more. And uh, let's see what we see how this will look. And then just a matter of filling out the control room. I need to kind of decide over here. I may put a door on the control room here and then this will be open out and in here. Uh, may have a platform out here. This will be kind of a maintenance type area. And uh, see how that ends up looking up. So I'll catch back up with you here in just a little bit. And then we're probably going to be getting close to calling it a video. All right, be back in a little bit. All right, I have uh, managed to get some more materials over here. Uh, I've kind of got this framed in. And so you can kind of see what it's going to look like. I went only one high because it's just a mining control room so it doesn't have to be a big big area so I think what I'm gonna do is I'll put the door here I gotta fill this out in here we can throw a few more blocks down right here fill that in that maybe come out to there uh, the door will be right here it'll come out we can probably uh, end up putting some cargo blocks here uh, this will end up being a ramp down to here. And let's see, I think. That's it there, yeah. All right. So you kind of get the f idea of what this is going to look like. This will have lighting out here. We'll light this up try to light this area up pretty well and uh, I think uh, we'll be able to uh, complete this in the next uh, episode uh, so let's kind of fill this in just kind of get a feel for how it looks I don't think I have the materials for this I need glass and steel plate and girders so uh, but I think that'll look pretty good let's hit this as much materials as I have on me. See if we can get this all the way across. Yeah. There we go. Now I might have to change the color scheme up a little bit in here. That red might be... Boy, well, once I get the lighting, it might not look too bad. All right. I think we're going to call the episode good right here. Uh, all you space engineers, keep building away out there. And if you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. It helps the video out a lot. And uh, please subscribe. That really helps the channel out a lot. And with that, Commander Kingfish is out of here. And I will see you all in the next episode. Thanks for watching, everyone.